Today I prepared for you homemade hand sanitizer. You need 91% alcohol or higher. If you can't find it locally, do not spend millions of dollars online. Just go get vodka. And I'm not kidding. So one cup of that, one cup of the purest aloe vera that you can find. This is on our Amazon link for you. It's amazing. We'll go ahead and slide that under the video. Too much hand sanitizer will dry your skin out. So I added Pearlescence 24 karat gold peptide infusion. It's on our Amazon link. If you can't find this, use vitamin E. Health Shield Therapeutic Grade Oil can help your immune system. You need 15 drops of this and whatever essential oils you like. We use a lot of citrus because we love citrus. It smells yummy. This is going to smell very alcoholy. Until you put it on your hand, the alcohol will then dissipate and your essential oils will shine through. We mix all the ingredients, put it into a Ziploc bag, fill the bottles, and you guys give it out to your family, your friends, your children. Smother yourself in it. I'm going to show you guys how to make Oreo Rice Krispies. Get 20 Oreos, crush them up into thick pieces, a half stick butter into the pan for five minutes until browned. Then add two whole bags of mini marshmallows until melted and gooey. Turn off your stove and add one teaspoon of vanilla extract and a pinch of salt and mix that together until gooey. Next, add in five cups of Rice Krispies cereal. Then just dump in your Oreos and give it a mix. Now pour into a pan and don't push down too firmly, just gently. Let them rest for 20 minutes and you're done.
Nutella, we're making it. So good. Eight ounces hazelnuts. Spread them evenly. Bake at 350 for 15 minutes. Place into a bag. Shake. No more skin. Place into food processor. Pulse until a paste forms. Perfect. Hey, Nutella without the chocolate. Add a cup of powdered sugar and a third of a cup of cocoa. Mix again. Drizzle in two tablespoons oil. Add vanilla, pinch of salt, quarter cup of chocolate chips. Blend. Beautiful homemade Nutella. Oh my gosh. It's so good. This is life changing. I used to think bread was evil, along with pasta, rice, and potatoes. And for a long time, I deprived myself of those foods, thinking I was being good. And then when I couldn't help myself anymore, and I binged on french fries or a crusty loaf of bread in the middle of the night with the lights off while my husband slept in the next room, I went to bed feeling like I'd committed a crime. I think what's really evil is this idea that we should ever feel guilty about the foods we eat, especially now. Last week, my mother's dog died, and I had to comfort her from at least six feet away while she held her Charlie in her arms, sobbing. And it made me mad and sad and frustrated and helpless that I just couldn't hug her. I woke up this morning feeling grumpy and tired, and listening to the news about how long it might be before things return to normal. I won't apologize for baking this focaccia, brushing it with a little extra olive oil, sprinkling it with more than a pinch of salt. I just won't. Strawberry lemonade. Two cups of strawberries and half a cup of water. Puree. Juice two large lemons. In a small jar, we're gonna add a fourth a cup of sugar and a fourth a cup of water. No shake until all the sugar is dissolved. Now get a big pitcher, add the lemon juice, the strawberry puree, and the sugar mixture. I'll load it up with some ice and add two cups of cold water. Give it a good stir. Okay, now the fun part. Put a few lemons in our jar, add some strawberries, a little bit of ice, pour it on in. Get those strawberries all mashed up. A lemon. Ah! Oh my goodness, look how cute this is. Oh, that's so good. Wow, I feel like I'm at Red Robin. Yum. This is incredible. I'm very happy. Have a happy day. I told y'all that's food at home. We making microwave quesadillas for those who can't use a stove because I got y'all. Cheese, seasoning, tortilla, fold it up, microwave for one minute, done. Wasn't that mad easy? If you want to get fancy schmancy, serve with some pico de gallo, lettuce, sour cream, and enjoy. Follow and share for more easy recipes.